Hello again folks. I've decided to use my amazing abilities as an extra normal super genius to diagnose and cure the afflictions of my fellow extra normal cartoon characters. So welcome to a new segment on our show. Ask Dr. Meanie. For our first guest. Oh crap. It's Fiona Pretzels, the feminist academic windbag who is always complaining that this show is offensive to women. Yes. It pains me to take part in this disgustingly misogynistic series. But I've been having terrible headaches, and I need your help. Well, never fear. Using my awesome technological wizardry, I'll fix you in no time. I know I'm going to regret this. Now folks, join me as we shrink down to microscopic size, and go on a fantastic voyage deep inside Fiona Pretzels. Computer, initiate program miracles from molecules. I'm down here, in the palm of your hand. Go ahead and swallow me. Okay, here goes. Gross. You taste like a moldy peanut. Well sunshine, your breath smells like stale bong water. As a militant lesbian separatist, the very idea of having a man inside of me makes me want to vomit. Please don't. This suit cost me 15 bucks at the thrift shop, and I'd hate to ruin it with a peach a granola puke. There's no time to argue. The computer will return me to normal size in just a few minutes. What? Why is it so soon? Mostly to give this episode some dramatic tension. Hang on, I'm gonna climb up in your sinuses. That tickles. I think I'm gonna sneeze. No don't. You might sneeze me right out of your nostril. <coughs> Oh my. I've triggered Fiona's immune system. You must be her white blood cells. Excuse me, but we don't appreciate being defined purely by the color of our membranes. Yeah. We prefer to be known as cellular citizens. Jesus. Even her leukocytes are pompous twerps. What's going on in there? Hang on. I've found the problem up here in your brain. You've been an annoying, overbearing, self-righteous shrew for so long that you've totally neglected your brain's pleasure center, and now it's all jammed up with dust and cobwebs. I just need to polish it up a little. Now I just need to get out of here before I... Oh no, it's too late. I'm about to enlarge. What? Oh no. What happened? You didn't enlarge. Yes I did. But because we're cartoon characters based on the exact same character model, it turns out I fit inside your skin perfectly. Get out of me immediately, you patriarchal parasite. Hang on, I'll try to wiggle out. Oh my. What's going on? Why do you suddenly feel so hot and sweaty in there? Oh my god. Are you getting horny inside me? I can't help it. When I wiggle inside you like that, it feels kind of... well. Oh god. I can actually feel you down there. Swelling. Engorging. Protruding. Tickling me, on the inside. I'm sorry. Your body is like a feminist academic lady suit with no zipper. No matter how much I wiggle. I'm stuck in here. Stop wiggling. The more you wiggle, the more I can feel every big, throbbing inch of your horrible, disgusting. Oh screw it. Just do me already. What? Oh yeah. Take that, you naughty little sexist pig. Hang on. Fiona. What are you doing? I can't stop. It's so wrong, but so good. Come on you hideous old troll, screw me from the inside. Oh my. Fiona please, the audience is watching. Yeah right. 
I've seen our page views. Nobody watches this shit. Fair enough.